Welcome, class, to a workshop on Coach Joe Rules. In this lesson, we will review Coach Joe Rule number 15, which states, Avoid long if statements. The author of this if statement captured a complex logical process and accurately determined when the condition was met. A true work of art. Unfortunately, this long, ugly if statement is a common junior-level developer mistake and should be avoided. You will write many if statements in your career. Everyone knows the purpose is to redirect the code execution based on the result of a decision. As an added benefit, your goal should be to make the statement easy to read, easy to fix, and require very little time to understand. Let me explain with a few examples. Look at this if statement. There is only one condition, and the expression is easy to read you will spend very little time understanding the decision being made. What is the intention of this if statement? There are two conditions separated by a logical operator. Again, you should spend very little time understanding the decision being made here. Examine this if statement that contains a formula. Did you recognize the Celsius to Fahrenheit conversion? Because some will not, this could take a little more time to understand. What is the intention here? This if statement contains one condition with a complex formula. Without a financial background, it may take a fair amount of time to understand the purpose. Examine this final if statement. What is going on here? This statement has many conditions, is poorly formatted, and difficult to read. Unless you have prior knowledge of this long and complicated if statement, you will spend a fair amount of time trying to understand the decision being made here. As you can see with these if statements, the amount of time needed to understand the decision process is based on the complexity of the if statement. Why are they bad? When you encounter a long if statement written by another developer, you're forced to stop inspect the code, and spend time trying to figure out the decision process. Instead, this statement should be easy to understand by any developer, not just the author. Ideally, the knowledge of the decision process should be captured in the code and shared with future developers. When a long if statement needs to be improved, consider abstraction. This complex if statement should be converted into a well-named method call and abstract away the details. Notice how can open magic door is easier to read and quickly reveals the intention of the decision. This helps developers quickly decide to move to the next line of code or investigate the details further. Inside this method, you can continue to abstract away the details. Take a smaller portion of the overall decision and make it a well-named variable or method. This helps document the process for future developers. After abstracting away all the conditions, notice the improved if statement. It is now easier to read, easier to maintain, and easier to understand. I challenge you to avoid long if statements with well-named method calls and abstract away the details while documenting the process with other well-named variables and methods. Leave a comment down below with solution ideas for reducing complexity of your long if statements. Look for other helpful Coach Joe videos. Remember, future senior developers, make it work, prove it works, then make it better. Ready? Break!